Hello there and welcome everyone. My name is Melissa Armo and I own the Stock Swoosh. I wanted to give you my market outlook for the month of October going up into the election. In my opinion, it's going to be a very, very choppy month. You're going to have days like today where you see the market gapping up and rallying. And then you're going to have days like you've seen in the last two weeks where the market sells off. You're, what volatility is, is you're expecting something, the market, stocks to go in a set direction and then it flips and it goes in the opposite direction. That could flip on the day or it could flip the following day in the gap, which is one of the reasons why gaps can be so profitable because you could be in something and then it goes in the opposite direction. So for example, volatility is something where you have a lack of follow through, okay? So I don't think the market makes brand new all-time highs in the next month. While it could, right after the election, we've got about 28 days to go. I don't think it's going to happen before the election. So what does that mean? That means we could be in a sideways range, choppy, up, down, up, down, up, down. And I think there's more room for us to fall or sell off than there is for us to rally. Because, again, I do not think the market is going to make brand new all-time highs before the election. There's too much going on. There's so many things going on. You almost can't even keep up with the news cycle that's going on. The Supreme Court justice hearings are starting this week. You have earning season starting next week. You have uh, the president in the hospital still. You have stimulus that Congress hasn't agreed on yet. You have an election in 28 days. You don't have a vaccine yet. So there's just so many things. Again, your job is not to follow all of those news cycles. Your job is to read the chart. That's my job. Again, I follow the news cycles because I speak on television and radio. But the fact is that I make trading decisions based on what the gaps are telling me to chart. So expect volatility this month of October. Don't put all your eggs in one basket. Don't risk the farm. And we'll wait and see where we go into the election cycle, into the beginning part of November. And of course, we're going to be in full swing earnings season by then as well. Good luck, everyone. If you're interested in learning more information about trading, email me and Melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Have a great day.